30, a local health district wants people to report when they test positive using one of those COVID at home tests. Yeah, officials are very worried with so many home tests happening right now. Channel 3 Waterbury Bureau Chief Dennis Valera explains it's not a concern for all public health departments in the state. More and more people are using at home COVID-19 self tests and state guidance says we do not have to report it if we test positive. So the Naugatuck Valley Health District just wants to make sure they're keeping track, creating this self report survey. It asks you questions like where you live, your vaccination status, even what test brand you used. The health district stresses it's about keeping the data current. The ultimate goal of this effort is to help you. The more data we have on the positivity rate, the more we are able to provide the necessary guidance, support and education to help our residents slow the spread of COVID-19 in our community. The health district covers six towns, Seymour, Shelton, Naugatuck and Sonia, Derby and Beacon Falls. Say multiple people in the same household test positive with at home tests. The health district wants each person to fill out a survey to keep an accurate count. We are not concerned about the self tests that people have received not being reported. Waterbury Health State Director Aisling McGuckin does not plan to implement something like that survey. She says while they're reliable, at home tests should not be counted with lab administered tests. The quality of the tests is completely dependent on user, um, you know, uh, accuracy, uh, the, the ability for the person who's taking the test to perform the test accurately. She adds the city has several other tools to track infection, like the weekly testing done in schools. Also, the city is part of a CDC study tracking the virus in wastewater. Through that, we're able to determine the viral load of, um, uh, of waste that is passing through the, the city's a wastewater treatment facility and uh, that's a good indicator of the level of infection in the community. A link to the survey will be on the Channel 3 app. In Seymour, Dennis Valera, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.